There's a big ruling in the NFL, or a decision made uh, by the NFL owners, uh, and that is that there will now be a punishment, uh, fines that will be meted out if NFL players kneel on the sidelines during the national anthem. Uh, they actually they have the option to stay in the locker room during the anthem, but if they're on the field, they have to stand. Otherwise, uh, there will be penalties. Um, and the, the league just announced this today, and they said that, uh, what, how much are the penalties? I didn't see that. Uh, bugs me. It bugs you? It bugs me. The yeah, it's bugging. I, I think the, the penalties are, are, are fines. So they haven't said how much the fines will be. They didn't say how, how much the fines were, were okay. going to be. Yeah. You know, it, 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 it bugs me because I remember as a kid, there was a big thing about the Pledge of Allegiance, which we always used to have to say in school, and there were a lot of people who didn't want to say it because they didn't want to say one nation under God. And it actually, there was a time when people said you had to say that, even mm -hmm. if you didn't believe in God or you didn't want your kid to say it. Right. And ultimately, we didn't have to do it if we didn't want to do it, but there was a lot of pressure and there were even penalties. You could get suspended if you defied the teachers. It feels like the same thing to me. And it's like, well, why can't people, look, if they kneel, they're making a statement. Uh, let me let me let me give you one guess about uh, who do you think is spiking, if I may use the uh, analogy, who's spiking the football? Well, the uh, NFL on this is decision. because there are players. No, no, no. Uh, about the NFL's decision. President Trump, of course. Mike Pence and Tr President yeah. Trump. Mike Pence, <laughs> Mike uh, Pence uh, took to Pence. social media. Uh, he he loved the idea. Obviously, he he tweeted something out with the hashtag winning. Um, so P Pence loves this this entire situation. And, I then, think the, and then President Trump retweeted what uh, right. Mike Pence Fox. tweeted. I, I yeah. think the interesting thing is what the flag symbolizes and what this actually symbolizes. The flag symbolizes the obviously freedom, freedom, freedom of speech, what the country's built on. And this to me is a little bit of the opposite of that. It's exactly exact the opposite, opposite of that. Opposite. And so, it's like I, I mean, t the the owners are, clearly don't see it that way. But I, well, are they just? I mean, that's are, been the are, argument are they, all along. Are they just protecting? their own pocketbook because they think that there are fans who aren't going to come to the stadium fans. if they if people do this is that what this is about i'm sure it has something to do with that i'm sure that's probably uh what they're doing but i also think that they're being a little wrong-headed here there's a change in social landscape out there these athletes and uh and, and influencers have a lot more access to information and they are going to be increasingly more involved. And it would have been a good idea to me if the NFL would have leaned in here to the players and tried to figure out some way uh, to, to help to raise their voices and not try to mute it. I have a question. Uh, by the way, the Players Union is uh, is looking into this and says that they will challenge it uh, if they... So suppose the Players Union loses. Could there be like a billionaire who really feels outraged by this, who basically says, I will bankroll fines. this and I'll pay all the fines? Uh, maybe. Maybe. I mean, I'm sure there'll be Maybe. a lot of guys that'll play that. The, the, how long does that last, though? This rule it wouldn't be going anywhere. And by the way, the NFL is not the only sports league that has this. The NBA has it, too. Like with NBA the, already has it? NBA already has it. Then hmm. you get fined? Uh, and yeah, in the NBA, you already have to uh, put your, I guess, like, salute the flag or whatever. Or I'm, stand surprised, up I'm surprised Adam Silver doesn't, doesn't do something about that. He that was a long like time ago. That was before his watch. It was a long time yeah. ago. Yeah. Okay.